Hello guys, Mukas here. What's up? So today I'm gonna explain how to join my outfit on Miller. We play NC and uh, a bit of varied gameplay. Sometimes we play infantry, sometimes in vehicles. Anything to get to our objective and anything to dominate the enemy. So we used to have uh, different uh, ways to recruit our members. Now I've, uh, I've simplified it to the maximum. So yeah, there is a few requirements, of course. Uh, you, of course you have to play NC on Miller, you have to be uh, mature and respectful. Uh, respectful is the very least, guys. I'll not tolerate uh, people being disrespectful to other members or people being, being negative or rude or mean. I'll not tolerate this. You need to speak and understand English. You can be from anywhere in the world, but you have to be able to speak English be because this is how we communicate. You have to be willing to obey orders. When we do squad squad up sessions, I expect you to obey orders. You need to have at least 280 months for the engineers. This is uh, the, the basic, basic, and the repair tool and medic tool at rank 3. So these are the requirements. This is the minimum if you want to apply to, to join us. So if you have this, how to join us, you need to join our community on Discord. I'm going to show you. It, it's right here. We have a community on Discord. And there, on the community, get an avatar for a Discord account so we can uh, recognize you easier. Here, you need to... You so first, you need to join the, the, our community on Discord. You need to read the NCIV guide. I'm going to put the link. It's our, it's our, it is our general guidelines on how to play with us and how to understand our communications and our mindset in general. Once you have done this, you can post your presentation. Your presentation is going to be uh, um, you, you um, presenting yourself to us so we can uh, have an idea of who you are. You need, to you need to answer all these questions in your presentation. You need to answer what's your name in game and on Discord. So we can uh, we have an idea of uh, who this is. How old are you? Uh, where are you from? The country and the city. Uh, so we can know. So, so we other members can know if you are neighbors with them or not. What do you do in real life? Are you a student? Are you working? What are you working? What what is your work? You're not uh, obliged to tell us details. Just tell us. Uh, or your field of experience or where you you're working what outfit you joined before NCIV if you joined be, uh, other outfits uh, before us I, I would like to know which ones <coughs> and the last question is why do you want to join NCIV you need to answer all these questions in your presentations or it's not going to be accepted if your if your presentation is uh, not accepted we're not going to uh, um, accept you in game so please answer all these questions and try to be uh, Try to write well so it's easy for us to read. And uh, this way you'll have your application in-game uh, accepted. Once you have posted your presentation on, on our Discord, you can apply in-game. In the game, in the outfit tab, you can find our outfit. It's called NCIV, NC Initiative. And if you have your presentation posted on our Discord, you should be accepted uh, as soon as possible by an officer. So don't forget to for, uh, answer all the questions or your presentation is going to be rejected. And some general hints, try to have the same name on Discord and in-game. It's going to make it easier for us to recognize you and to, to, and to and identify the, the people we're playing with. Try to set up a screen recording software like OBS or Shadowplay so you can record your squ squad play sessions with us. Maybe this can be useful for, for our videos uh, later on our NCAV channel. So once you have presented yourself, say hello in the lobby. Say hello. Uh, and um, and uh, this is uh, you, you should be now part of the outfit after you have presented yourself uh, correctly. So subscribe to the NCIV YouTube channel. This is because uh, we're going to post uh, NCIV updates there. Updates about the outfit, about the game. Uh, we're going to post gameplay with other squad members so you can see how the other squad members are playing and we're going to post squ squad uh, in useful information about squad play so you should uh, absolutely sub subscribe to this channel you're going to be uh, there's going to there's going to be a lot of in important information there so this is how to join NCIV our our outfit on um, on discord once you have joined us the announcement channel is for the of if official news on plain 2 this is this channel called the uh, announcement. This one is for official news about the, the outfit and the game. The lobby is when where you say hello once you have presented yourself. 
and uh, where, where I'm going to put some general announcement like uh, I'm going to do a squad play session in one hour or in half an hour or if you're looking for someone to play with you can ask it in the lobby presentation is where you answer the questions general talk is for the talk that are non-related to, to the game if you want to talk about uh, girls or if you want to talk about travels you can talk about it here in the general tab Council is a, is a channel just for the, the officers, it's a private channel for officers. NCIV text is a, this channel is for anything related to the game, uh, like uh, if you want to talk about something that happened uh, in game, you can talk about it in the NCIV text. NCIV text is where we're going to post about our tactics and uh, how we want to play together and the best tactics to, to apply for our outfit. The council, actually, yeah, it's a pri private channel for officers. Sh sheet post is any anything you want to talk about, if, uh, if anything you want to talk about, in, uh, even if it's not politically correct, you can post it in the sheet post. So after that, once you have uh, joined us, the the things that are absolute that are really important for our squad play sessions is to have this this unlocks. I'm gonna list them here. So the the repair tool and the, and the, and the revive tool at rank five. 380 mines for the engineer and the, and the mine carrier for the engineer which allows you to carry two more mines this means you can carry three mi uh, five mines 2c4 for the light assault for, for we're gonna, when we're going to do some kamikaze missions I'm going to ask you to pull this the routing spire construction item this is extremely useful to set up spawns a reserve bar barrier for the engineer this can be useful in point holds and to protect the router a smoke launcher for the medic or engineer you can have it uh, in the under bar barrel of a Ghost S rifle or in the under barrel of a Warden battle rifle. So one close range SMG for the infiltrator, I recommend the Cyclone or the N7 PDW or the Blitz. This because sometimes we often need an infiltrator to hack the terminals and it's better if he has a, a loadout that is more close to medium range and this is uh, so it, this is better to have an SMG compared to a bolt action rifle. So for the sender, you need to have a deployment shield. This is extremely important when we set up spawns. We usually use this option, the deployment shield, because it's easier to defend. Uh, one, sh one, sender one sender with the gate shield diffuser, for when we, when we want to crash shields, usually in amp stations. A repair module for senders, for when we, s when we pull sender balls. Sometimes we pull several senders together to make them repair each other. Racer chassis fi uh, 3 for the sender, so he can go faster, he can catch up with our senders. Stealth for the Valkyrie, for when we do uh, Valk drops on enemy spawns or on uh, a control point. An AV option for the harasser, like for example the Enforcer, the Molnir or the Halberd. Stealth for the harasser, so you don't make uh, your friendly harasser get spotted. Double AI for the max, this means a scat scat scatter cannon in each arms, or one scatter cannon and one grinder. This is the cheapest option. This is so we can have an anti infantry max. Sometimes we pull them to four point holds. And finally, the ordnance armor for your max, so you can resist C4 and uh, and explosives and rockets. So these are the really important unlocks that you should try to get as soon as you you're in the outfit, because um, I'm gonna use I'm gonna ask you often ask you to you to pull them, use them to to support the group. All right. So these were the requirements to join NCIV and the general guidelines on how to use our Discord. So all everything is, is uh, centralized in our Discord. Here, you can can see our members here and uh, talk about anything you like. So up at the top is the text chat, and at the bottom is at the is the voice chat. If you want to talk about something, you can stay in the chill out, and people can join you to talk. So this is how it worked with NCIV. It used to be different. We, before that, we had a Google Plus page and a subreddit, but we're transitioning to make it simpler for everyone. All right. So that's it. I hope to see you on the battlefield and um, see you soon. Stay epic.